One of the missiles that was tested was long range hypersonic missile. This is the government has not given a lot of details. Government has not given a lot of details yet. So let's understand what was this. Achha, before we go to uh, DRDO testing this missile, let us understand what is hypersonic missile. Do we understand what is supersonic? Anything which is traveling with a speed more than the speed of? sound that supersonic hypersonic is anything that's traveling with a speed more than five times the speed of sound supersonic up speed of sound se other rate pe travel kar rahe ho. hypersonic up five times the speed of sound se jada rate pe travel kar rahe hai. those missiles are hypersonic missiles do we get this pakka now a hypersonic missile is a weapon system which flies at least at the speed of mach 5 that is five times the speed of sound and is maneuverable. That's very important. So it's not a ballistic missile. You are able to maneuver it. That is unlike ballistic missiles which follow a fixed trajectory. Hypersonic missiles can alter their course making them significantly harder to detect. Now there are two kinds of hypersonic missile. One is hypersonic glide vehicle. Other is hypersonic cruise missiles. Hypersonic glide vehicles use what is known as aerodynamic lift for maneuverability. What is aerodynamic lift? Aerodynamic lift is the same principle by which birds are able to stay in the air and they are able to change its path or something similar to what airplanes are able to do. With a heavy airplane, it's not falling on the ground. It's able to remain in the air. Uske piche aerodynamics involved hai. है ना आप पतंग को देखोगे वो ऊपर जा रहा होता है तो सारे फैक्टर्स है अभी अभी विल नॉट गो इनटू दैट बट हाइपरसोनिक ग्लाइड व्हीकल में व्हाट हैपेंस अ मिसाइल एट वेरी हाई स्पीड एट हाइपरसोनिक स्पीड इज गोइंग टुवर्ड्स द टारगेट एंड देन इट इज आल्सो एबल टू ग्लाइड मैनेवरेबिलिटी इज देयर सो दैट जब वो गिर रहा है लाइक नो द लेट्स से रशिया लॉन्चेस अ हाइपरसोनिक missile with this gliding ability on us otherwise detecting it would have been possible but now you'll be able to glide it leading to what leading to its detection becoming more difficult then there is hypersonic crude missile cruise missiles they are powered by air breathing scramjet engines that uh, these missiles sustain hypersonic speed throughout their flight so they'll be hypersonic throughout the flight and throughout the flight they'll have an engine, an engine which will be giving it the force that is needed and ability to change its direction. The engine which is generally used in hypersonic cruise missiles are scramjet engine, air breathing scramjet engine. Achha, to what is scramjet engine? Do we do we understand? Batai. Aise samjho, dekho kya hota hai na? Sometimes when we'll study rockets, when we'll study PSLV, GSLV, these rockets, rockets go up. When they go up, they go at very high speed. And in the upper atmosphere, you don't even have oxygen. And that is why it will also carry oxygen. Either in case of liquid fuel, liquid oxygen is carried. They say liquid hydrogen, we take liquid oxygen. Or they uh, say solid fuel hoga usme they carry compound jo jo ki oxygen release kar raha hoga but here in in case of rocket in case of missiles it it doesn't have to go into the space it has to remain in the atmosphere so what may happen it may take oxygen from outside that is air breathing did you understand the meaning of air breathing so here we have a rocket which has fuel which is burning its fuel using air which is coming from or using oxygen which is coming from air we are breathing in air and we are taking oxygen and burning fuel in our body carbohydrate is getting oxidized with the help of oxygen that we are taking in scramjet engine may be ye hoga and now it's a difficult thing to achieve because the the speed at which the air enters the 
इंजन आप देखो दिया जला रहे हो वहां पे ऑक्सीजन की जरूरत है बट हवा बहुत तेज आएगी दिया बुझ जाएगा तो मेंटेनिंग फ्लेम हेयर इज अ डिफिकल्ट टास्क एंड दस डेवलपिंग दिस इंजिन आर ऑल्सो डिफिकल्ट बट दिस इज अनदर वे इन विच हाइपरसोनिक मिसाइल्स कैन बी क्रिएटेड नाउ दीज हाइपरसोनिक मिसाइल आर दे केपेबल ऑफ कैरिंग कन्वेंशनल वेपन और न्यूक्लियर वेपन दोनों ले जाओ यार <laughs> रख के लेके तो जाना है कैन कैरी कन्वेंशनल ऑल्सो यू कैन कैरी न्यूक्लियर ऑल्सो तो कंट्रीज विच हैव दिस केपेबिलिटी राइट नाउ रशिया चाइना एंड यूएस हैज दिस केपेबिलिटी बट अ नंबर ऑफ अदर कंट्रीज आर वर्किंग ऑन इट फ्रांस जर्मनी ऑस्ट्रेलिया जापान ईरान एंड इसराइल आर वर्किंग ऑन इट अचीविंग और डेवलपिंग हाइपरसोनिक मिसाइल इज अ चैलेंज बिकॉज वन इट ट्रेवल्स एट हाइपरसोनिक स्पीड वेरी हाई स्पीड एंड दस द हीट दैट इट विल बी जनरेटिंग एक तो लोअर में लोअर एरिया में ट्रेवल कर रहा होगा तो फ्रिक्शन बहुत सारा हीट दैट इट विल बी जनरेटिंग वुड बी वेरी हाई एंड दस द मटीरियल दैट वी नीड इज शुड बी हेवली हीट रेजिस्टेंट नहीं तो ऊपर ही पिघलना शुरू हो जाएगा सेकेंड इट वुड नीड प्रिसाइज नेविगेशन अनलाइक बलिस्टिक मिसाइल आपने लॉन्च कर दिया अब प्रोजेक्टाइल मोशन लॉज ऑफ फिजिक्स विल टेक इट देयर हेयर यू नीड हेयर यू नीड वॉट यू नीड प्रिसाइस एबिलिटी टू नेविगेट एंड थर्ड कॉस्ट ऑफ मैन्युफैक्चरिंग इज हायर इवन देन दैट ऑफ बलिस्टिक मिसाइल्स दीज आर सम ऑफ द चैलेंजेस विच कम्स टू डेवलपमेंट ऑफ हाइपरसोनिक मिसाइल्स now the hypersonic missile that has been tested by india in on 27th the missile developed by drdo is designed to carry various payloads for ranges greater than 1500 km so our hypersonic missile that we have tested has a range of 1500 km and it was tested at max 6 that is 6 times the speed of sound its country's first long range hypersonic missile we had a we had supersonic missiles as a brahmos is a supersonic missile that is brahmos travels at a speed more than the speed of sound but hypersonic more than 5 times the speed of sound this is country's first long range hypersonic missile iska aap dekhoge pehle na in 2019 drdo has had tested hypersonic technology demonstrator there they had created a small component then you will also see a second test was done in september 2020 to extend scramjet power cruise missile For HSTDV, which flew 22, 23 seconds at max six speed after separation from the launch vehicle of solid rocket. Now it has been tested, but as I said, we are not giving a lot of details here because government itself has also not given a lot of details about this missile. But see, it was that we have tested a hypersonic missile. This was the thing in news, but. this is an achievement that has put the country in select group of nations having the weapon that can strike with extreme speed and evade most air defense system so it has significance very few countries have this capability india has been able to develop this capability so very high speed missile usko detect karke destroy karne ke bhi scope kam rehta hai when the missile is moving slowly identifying it detecting it destroying it is feasible so this ensures our more uh, offensive capabilities okay this is it about it abhi iske bare mein aur zyada when when the government gives more information we'll be able to study more about it